Have you ever wanted to know exactly what your students are thinking? Well, now you can with this amazing mind reading trick. Hey guys, welcome to Andy, the ESL guy. On this channel, I upload weekly videos on games, tips and techniques. If you haven't already, please consider hitting the like button and subscribing. Cheers. Now, let's get to it. So recently I've been using this activity as a warm up for my middle school and high school classes. If you want, you can make a PPT detailing each of the instructions or simply do as I do and write each step on the board. Now, I've asked my wife to take part in this activity today just to show you guys how it's done. Now, it's her first time doing it, so hopefully it works. And why not try along at the same time, see if I can read your mind. At the end of the video, I'll explain exactly how it's done. Okay, are you ready? Let's go. Think of a number between 1 and 10, and don't say it out loud, okay? Now, this is your secret number. Okay, so I want you to multiply that number by 2. Okay. Okay? So, then add 8 to that number. Okay? So, now what I want you to do, divide that number by 2. Okay. And subtract the original number that you thought of. Okay, so the secret number. Mm. Now, I want you to convert that number to a letter of the alphabet. So, if number one, it would be A. If number two, it would be B. Okay? Mm. And think of any country in the world that starts with that letter. Okay, okay you got it? So, now, I want you to move on to the next letter in the alphabet. Okay, so after A is B, okay? Okay. Now, think of an animal that starts with that letter. And what color is that animal? Okay. Are you thinking of a gray elephant from Denmark? How do you know that? <laughs> okay guys, hopefully it worked for you and you got a gray elephant from Denmark. Now, if your student's English vocabulary maybe isn't that great, just cancel out the D for Denmark. Okay, so how this works, any number that you choose, you will always come back to number four due to the maths. Okay, so you're always going to get letter D, skip on to letter E. Most people think elephant, what color is the elephant? It's gray. Okay guys, hopefully this worked for you and you can try in your class to blow your students' minds. Cheers and see you in the next video.